bit thirsty. Anyway, hello, hello, la. Hmm. Bad way to start. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another video. As you can see in the title, it's a, it's a vlog. And it's just a shout out to, well, a lot of people who wants, who've been wanting a shout out as well on this channel. Um, at the moment, I'm just on the way to Cashew Curry in every street. Need to get some bits and bats. Um, those who've been wanting a shout out, I am more than happy to give you a shout out, to be honest. Um, I'm grateful to everyone who's been watching my videos, whether you're old or young. So I am I'm really grateful. So if you want a shout out, I'm more than happy to give you one, to be honest. And thank you for watching. Also, the first shout out, it's a massive shout out again. I've already given him a shout out, but it's his birthday today. At the moment, it's Friday for me, it's Jumma. Got me Shirok, he's on today. <laughs> um, but the video's going on Saturday and it's his birthday. So, again, massive shout out to Subhan Iqbal from Nelson as well. Hope you have a great day. Um, get a lot of chocolate and stuff. Um, presents. Hope you have a great day that day. So, I'm a bit tired as well. I slept well, I don't know why I'm tired, but yeah. Hope you have a great day. And another shout out is to uh, Jibby Iqbal. I don't know if he's the same person, but I doubt it. Uh, Jibby Iqbal. He's actually commented on the video with the Chester's. He told me to do a food review on chunky chicken. I will at some point. The uh, thing is, though, the price is a bit high for a meal. It's about £9 and one pence from Just Eat. It might be a bit uh, uh, cheaper if you go to the restaurant, but on Just Eat, it's about nine quid for a burger meal. It's chips. I'm not sure if you get drinks, but I will I will give it a go. Last time I've had chunky chicken, it was about a year, maybe two years ago. But I will give it a go anyway. But shout out to Jibby as well. And there's a few more actually, I just bear with me. Anyway, um, another shout out to Khalil Beg, uh, his friends Adam, Yahya, Ishaq and Moise. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe as well if you haven't. Massive subscribes, get your mates, other mates to subscribe as well. But yeah, massive shout out to them as well who've been watching my videos. A few commenting as well. So yeah, massive shout out to him as well. Um, there's another one uh, as well that I need to give a shout out. So uh, shout out to Zulfikar. No, sorry, not Zulfikar. Z it might be Zulkanain. Zulkanain, sorry. I don't know why Zulfikar in my head. But anyway, shout out to Zulkanain from Slough. Uh, it's a bit of a trek for me anyway, but um, shout out to him as well. He's been watching my videos as well and was recommended from uh, his Osman boy who was who had a shout out before. So shout out to him. So anyone who gets a shout out, give me a, give me a shout out. I'll give you a shout out because I am really grateful for everyone who's been watching. Seriously, I am. Um, but yeah, his shout outs to them as well. Hope you all are all great and have a great day. Ramadan's coming as well, so let's get to that as well. But yeah, I think that's about it for the shout-outs. Let me just check my phone again. If there's anyone else that I need to shout out as well, just bear with me. Actually, I think that's it. That's it. Um, just walking back from uh, Chowdhury's Cashy Curry, got some stuff. Actually having a uh, chicken tikka and naan today. Not a uh, takeaway, homemade. So, um, once it's done, I'll show you our chicken tikka and naan for a while, actually. Homemade is even better. So I'll show, I will sort of show, yeah, show you how uh, our missus is going to make it. Um, got some yeast and stuff raising flour for the uh, for the naan, and I got some uh, chicken, chicken breast for the for the ticket. And then I'll show you, and uh, I'll show you later. It's going be good. It will be good. This is uh, food is always brilliant. So yeah, nothing else going on today. So I'll see you when I get the food. You might be thinking uh, he's talking's a bit slow. Hang on. Massive van there. This my slow is uh, my slow, but speaking's a bit slow. It has been for the past uh, couple of days actually. Fair enough. I had my injection Thursday. 
and after that I'm knackered after that anyway, I have no clue what's going on that day. And this is a day yesterday actually, so my speech might be a bit slow today, anyway, but even before that, for some reason my speech hasn't been the best. Not sure why, I've been sleeping on and off to be honest. My sleep's not good. Hadid is at the school actually, I can hear him. Where I'm walking is at the school's there, so I'm sure I heard him. Because <laughs> he's, he's quite loud, <laughs> but uh, yeah. Sorry, so if, I'm, uh, if I talk a bit sore, I am. I do apologise. But yeah, hope everyone's well. Alright, so here's a little bit of a conversation for you. Like I said, it's Friday for me, and it's Jumma. There's uh, a few people who say Jumma Mubarak. So there's, um, I call myself, and in my head as well, I keep myself Muslim. I don't tell myself I'm a Salafi, or I'm a Brailvi, or I'm a Tabligi, or the Abandi, or whichever you call yourself, Shia, whatever. I'm not Shia, by the way. I'm not Brailvi either. I'm not a Salafi, I'm not a Tabligi. Right? But there is a lot of people, they like to call them, yes, I'm a Salafi, or yes, I'm a Brailvi, yes, I'm a Sufi, or that type of thing. So yeah, Jumma Mubarak. Right? I know mainly the Salafis. They say it's bidah, most of them say it's bidah for everything anyway. But um, what do you think? Jumma Mubarak said it is. Is it bidah or is it all right? It's just it's Jumma, you're saying, well, happy Friday type of thing, right? With me, I'm not too, I'm not sure. So, yeah, it is type of an image. It is a bit of a bidah to be honest because it was uh, the Prophet, I don't think, used to say it. However, all, you, all you're really saying is Happy Friday, really. So I'm not too sure. So if you want to comment on there, go for it. If not, just keep it in your head. I'm not too bothered. But yeah, I just thought a little bit of something during the call. But yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, Jumma. That's the Masjid I'm going to Medina. I've been going since I was near was, you know, enough. I was born. My dad used to take me. Obviously, it was an old Masjid there. It was in Freak, Freak Street then, was it? Yeah, just it used to be the bull. Um, what's it called? The pub then, and then there was a masjid there. And then obviously it's a bigger masjid now. So this is the masjid I go to. You see from there. And it's taking my beer again. So I'll uh, yeah, talk to you later. Just walking back. Um, I know I was just stirring a bit on the, with the. Uh, Ramadan Mubarak type of thing, not Ramadan Mubarak, see without Ramadan soon. Um, Jumma Mubarak thing. At the end of the day you can debate with it, right? Whether you whether with the Salafis or the Brailvis or to because you could debate with it. At the end of the day you just it's all about respect. Whichever masjid you go to, in Nelson, whether it's Medina Masjid or Osiya Masjid or Muhammadi Mosque or whichever masjid there's plenty of masjid in Nelson, it's all about respect. The masjid I go to is because there is a bit of loyalty there. My dad used to take me, probably since I was two or three. I used to mess about when I was two or three as well, the kids. But that's the loyalty there because I go to that masjid because there. If I was like early for Jummah or something, or was it early for any of the bars, the masjids there, I'll go. Whether it's Medina masjid, go see a mosque, Wamdi mosque, you know, look around, whichever. It's all about respect at the end of the day. And if you go debating, have respect then as well. You don't need to start shouting at people. Say, Lord, bro, you can't say Jamal Mubarak, bro, it's bidah. You just start shouting at people. Have a bit of respect. It's there, what they believe. If, you, if it's wrong for you, or it's right for you, it's all about respect. I'm not the best, mas uh, best, the best Muslim myself. I expect, with both things, I'm very lazy. I'm not five time. I used to be. A lot of Fajr, Maghrib, Maghrib, Zuhur, Asr, Isha. I used to go a lot. I think since I got married, at least I've been really lazy. Extremely lazy. And that's on me. I need to get myself back onto that. Especially Ramadan as well. They will help as well, but I am lazy. Not people watching this. He only goes with Jumma, same with myself. It's all about your mentality as well. Same with me. I need to get back into it. Same with everyone else. If you're a five-time 
the mod, and that's good. I mean, the noise is good, but we need to help ourselves at the end of the day. Anyway, nearly on. Talk to you soon. Um, sorry, everyone. This uh, I was a bit actually a bit busy. Okay, and I went to all mortgages and stuff as well, and I forgot to make a video on the food. So I'm sorry. The food was great. So, but yeah, it's going to be the end of this video anyway. Hope everyone is well. And Hadid is here as well. Hello YouTube. You know why I'm holding this? You don't know why? Because I got TV in my room. At the moment we're in the living room. But yeah, he's got that anyway. But don't you watch it? Not much. I watch it more than he does. But anyway, hope. Watch, he watches film on it. Sometimes. Oh, also today I might watch the Justice League one, the new one. Um, it's a four-hour video. I might put some commentary on it and make put a video on that. I'm not too sure. But anyway, go here as well. Make sure. Bye. And I hope to make sure you like subscribe as well. And I'll see you all soon. In.